Hey, what is going on, guys? TL Sports 15 here, and today we have some more Toronto Maple Leafs GM mode. So let's get right into it. You can see we were the Stanley Cup champions, and Syracuse Crunch got the Calder Cup. So we're almost at the draft. This episode is just going to be the draft, and I think we're going to have enough money to resign all of our players because uh, we had $13 million the whole season. Maybe we can make a little bit of a splash in free agency. I just hope that all my players can improve and if that happens then we should be the shoe in to win the Stanley Cup next year. Uh there's there's a few things that I might do. Uh, I was thinking of keeping James Ryan for this year and next year probably. Uh so yeah, whenever this loads we'll check the stats and then we'll get uh we'll check out all our scouting and stuff. Sorry, and then we'll go to the draft. So we got the prospects game coming up. You can see that this uh, pro uh, there was three eighty plus overall guys that were still in free agency. I'm just trying to point some random stuff out. If this would continue simulating, we could go. Uh, so yeah, players will age regardless of their actual date of birth. So everybody gets a year older this year. Um. So is it? Yeah, I think this is where all the players' stuff improves. So we'll check out how all of our guys progress in this episode too. So yeah, uh, we'll check out the retired players: Chris Kelly, Matt Cullen, Samuelson, Willie Mitchell, UC Jokinen, Mark Savard, uh, Thomas Caberlet, Zidlicki, Chimera, Karkner, Chris Phillips, Lankow. Jason Blake, Belanger, Sopel, Sullivan, Boyle, that's a big one, uh, Salvador, uh, Hendrick Talinder, Hammerlick, Eliash, Hanzus, Wade Redden, Brendan Morrison. So there's a lot of uh, retired players there. So hopefully we can, yeah, we'll just go like this so we can stop the simulation. So first things first, let's go check out the awards from this season. And hopefully we won quite a few. So we won the Stanley Cup after Carolina won back-to-back -back in year one and two. So year three Stanley Cup champions were the Toronto Maple Leafs. President's Trophy goes to the LA Kings. Calder, C Calder, I mean, sorry. It's getting a little late. Clarence as Campbell. And that went to the San Jose Sharks. And then the Prince of Wales went to the Toronto Maple Leafs. Art Ross went to Ovechkin. Hart Memorial Vetchkin, James Norris, Drew Doughty, Lady Bing went to Jonathan Drewen, so that's pretty good. He got the Sportsmanship Award, so that's pretty cool. Calder Memorial went to Yakupov, so yeah, that he got the like the Rookie of the Year. We haven't won a Rookie of the Year yet, so uh, Con Smythe, so that's pretty cool. We got the James Reimer. We saw that in the last video. Vesna Trophy went to Cam Ward. William M. Jennings went to Cam Ward. Bill Masterton went to Braden Colburn. Colborn. Uh, Frank J. Selke went to Kessler. And Ted Lindsay went to Ovechkin. Maurice Richard went to Ovechkin. And that is all your awards for the season. So, yeah, that's that. We'll go check out the scouting. And we'll check out how our players were progressed throughout the season. And then we'll go to... The draft, which is the main part of this video. So, Connor McDavid, uh, Val Tchenko, uh, and this guy. These three guys are the three big guys in this draft. I would write, I would like to get Connor McDavid. He's a uh, pretty, I think he's going to be like 50 overall or something. He's pretty bad right now. But uh, this is probably going to be a 10-year GM. So, yeah, he'll probably be good by the end of it. Uh, this is guy is a D. He looks a little, this guy looks a little bit better. So this guy, if we need somebody for like next year, maybe he could play like six, top like 60. Uh, Zherov, uh, this guy looks pretty good. So maybe we can get him. We'll see what our picks are as we get in there. We'll check out the goalies right now. So, oh, this right wingers. There, here we go. There's no really good goalies. Uh, there's Whistle and Lots. So, not too many good goalies there. And now the part that I really want to check out is this. We go to contracts. 
and we'll go check out how everybody progressed. So FNUF is at an 89, Morgan Riley's an 88, so that's pretty cool. Is Morgan Riley a top two yet? So we got another top two right there. Uh, let's actually go by position by position. So centers, Druin is up to an 88, Shifley's up to an 88, Codger's up to an 82, Colburn is 81, Connolly is 80, so that's pretty good. McClellan's 78 still. Uh, Galchenyuk still at a 73. Grigorenko's at a 72. Uh, Boyce Rotoval still at a 60. So that's our centers. Left wing, Huberto got up to an 87 as well as JVR. I think JVR was at a 86 last year, I want to say. Uh, and then left wingers, we don't have too many left wingers. Uh, Levo is he's a three and a half star and he's a 70 now. So that's pretty good. On the right side, we got Kessel, who's an 88 now. Fratton, who's an 86. That's pretty good. Bobby Ryan, who went down to an 85. Carter Ashton, who is up to a 78, so he might be playing on the fourth line or something. Uh, this guy, he's three and a half star potential. He's 77 now, uh, and that's pretty much all that. Uh, we got the four, this four star right winger. Uh, he's 53 overall. Now defensive, defense wise, uh, we have Fnuf and Riley, who are going to be top twos. I want to see if Dougie Hamilton's the top two yet. I uh, know he's still top four, so we got two top twos, which is pretty cool, and then we got two top fours, I believe. Yeah, so these. Uh, Dougie's up to an 86, and Riley's up to an 88, so we got, these, this is a really solid decor up here, and then we got Polak, who's an 83, which is really solid, Holzer, who's a 78, uh, do we have any other prospects, we still have Connor Murphy, uh, so yeah, I would like to get one more D to fill that out, because Corbini Holzer's making, he made 2.1 million dollars this year, so uh, we could definitely get somebody that's a lot better than him, because I think he only scored like one goal like the past two years or something. We'll go check out his stats. Yeah, in the past like f three seasons in the NHL, he scored two goals. So and he's played every single game. So yeah, we're probably gonna want to get rid of Corbin Holzer and sign somebody else. Oh yeah, I forgot to check out what Reimer, Optimus Reimer. I want to see what he progressed to. And what our other goalie progressed to. So Reimer's up to an 84. And Palzes is up to a 66. So Reimer's probably going to be playing another year with us. Because he was he had a really solid year this year. So uh, even though he's only an 84. Uh, he's still starting goalie. And I really like him. So we're going to roll with him. So let's get right into this draft. See what picks we have. See what trades we can make. All that good stuff. We'll go continue. And we'll go into the draft. So... Uh, I think we might we might not have any, many picks. I have no idea, so we'll see when we get in there. Da -da 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 -da. Let me just grab a sip of water. Mm. Okay, here we go. I'm ready for this draft. Whenever this loads up, here we go. So we have the 14th pick, uh, and um, I'll just write down who has the top three. Uh, Florida, well, Colorado, Florida, and New Jersey, just so I don't have to go searching through. So we'll go, we'll look at Florida first. No, Colorado first, sorry. Colorado, their pick. They want to get rid of it, so that'd be pretty cool if we can get it. Second, they want, who do they want from these guys? Who has a lot of trade value that I don't really want? Uh, Kadri I want, Colbert I want. Connolly Holzer, no, he has one year left, so they wouldn't take him. I gotta remember that. I've forgot about that the f past few years. So, uh, Colburn Codry, Bobby Ryan is a no because he has one year left. Fratton, no. Polak, Huberto, no. So, I don't think well, we can throw on the first. Um,. And then maybe we could give up, like, a coal burn. Because then that'll save us a little money. Just a little bit of money. And then we could use that on somebody else. Uh, Would that go through? No, it wouldn't go through because we have to take somebody back. We'll take this guy back. We could try it. Uh, I hope it goes through. That'd be pretty sick. Cause then we can get one of those, one like one or two, one of those guys. Sorry. So we'll try it. I know I don't really want to give up Colburn because he's a good third liner, but he's probably gonna get a little worse if we play him on the third line 
for too much longer. Let's try this without Colburn first, because I really like Colburn. We'll see if there's anything else we could throw in. Uh, throw in Dorset. We could throw in Bull. J oh, wait. Can't throw in Dorset, because then they'll obviously decline that. Uh, Connolly is a no. I would like to get rid of Connolly, but he only has one year left, so. I could throw in. No, I don't want to give up Colnor. Or Pear, or Brown, I mean. Uh, is there any other D we could give up? Connor Murphy, even though he that they don't want him. I'll throw in Bystrom, and we'll see if this will go through. Hopefully it will. Uh, we got to take on some more guys right here. So take on this guy and one more. So hopefully this will go through. We'll try it. No. Fuck. So we have one more try to get one of those top three picks. Let's go to Florida. Let's go to Florida. We'll try them. The Florida Panthers, so they have the second overall pick. They don't want to give it up. And then the other team was the New Jersey Devils. Third pick, they do want to give it up. So do they want They want our second? Hopefully they want some more guys, some different guys. Yeah, they want a lot of guys. Uh, so we'll go to the bottom. They want Connor Murphy. We can give up Connor Murphy. Even though he's four stars, I wouldn't mind giving up Connor Murphy. Uh, Frat, no. Galchenik is a no. Levio, he has a lot of trade value for just a three and a half star guy. This right here will probably go through. Just uh, second and Levo for the first. Well, we could try it. We'll throw in some. Well, I just want to make sure. I want to confirm this will go through. Because if it doesn't, then this is our last try. Uh,. Connor Murphy, Bystrom is a no because he has one year left. This guy, he's a four-star. We'll just try it like this. If it doesn't go through, I'd be so surprised. Uh, that'd be uh, that'd be so surprising. So we can get the third overall pick for Levo and the second ra our second round pick. Let's see if it'll go through. Yes, it did. So we got the third overall pick. Which is pretty good. So we have the third and the fourteenth overall pick. McDavid went first. Uh, the I think that was the D that went second, and then uh, uh, we'll go with this guy. He was actually, he had pretty decent stats. Uh, maybe we could trade for Connor McDavid because I really like Connor McDavid. So yeah, we will do that. And is there any other good players? Uh Who's like huge? Six foot six. That's pretty big. Six foot five. Uh, we'll go with that six six guy. He seemed pretty big. Six six. Oh wait, where is he? One hundred fifteen pounds from Ukraine. Shoots left. Two way defender. Uh, so we'll go with him. Unless uh. I want to go with, like, let's go with the Parish. It doesn't matter. It doesn't really matter. We'll auto-draft the rest of this, and this will take a while to load. Hopefully, it will load pretty quick. So, yeah, we got the Zarov guy. He'll be pretty good. Uh, he I, Out of overall, I looked at all three guys' stats, and I think the Zarkov guy had the best stats, like, attributes, just for, like, as of now. I would have liked to get Connor McDavid more, but what are you going to do? So, we're going into year four next year. It'll be pretty interesting. After winning the Stanley Cup in year three, that'll be pretty cool. And I hope this loads fast. Come on. Let's go. Okay, let's go. How about that? So, yeah, there we go. So we're gonna go after we're gonna check out Colorado and let's go just go to contracts first and then we'll check out what that guy's overall is. Uh we'll go to where is he? 
Zarkov, he's already a 77 overall and he's 19 years old, so that's pretty sick. He's own, he's already 77 overall, so he could be playing in our NHL team the first year. Uh, he's a depth forward right now. I just want to go check out the Florida pick, who they got, and the Colorado. So, I'm pretty sure that, where is he? Where is Colorado? So, Colorado, there's... Connor McDavid, he's only 59 overall, but he's 18 years old. He's pretty sick still. And then the Florida pick, I just want to see quickly. Okay. Uh, he's an 80 overall. He's pretty sick. He's probably already, like, a, maybe even a top four. He's a top six, but this guy was probably the most prized possession of this draft. Uh, so, yeah, the those two guys were the guys that were went in this year's draft. So, we will sim up here and i will that'll be it for this episode guys so i'll see you guys all in the next one peace